This is a great one to do with the whole family, I think. Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. Today we are going to be doing a fun marble pour. So there's several ways to do this. I'm gonna kind of explain as I go, but I'm gonna go ahead and get started by filling my cup. I'm using all Mixed Media Girl pouring paints and I'm using primarily warm colors, but with a dash of the turquoise in there. I'm using Merlot as a good deep contrasting color. And then I've got some Razzle Dazzle and then some of the Fairy Dreams for a nice, beautiful metallic. And I'm gonna go ahead and just layer these. of paint here and now I'm gonna go ahead and pour over the marble now don't try to be perfect with this it doesn't actually matter um, you're kind of essentially doing a tree ring and then the marble is going to be wrecking it and now I've done this another way which is to put the marble in the cup with all the paint and flip cup it that is also super duper duper fun but I'm not sure I think I might like this way better And that, uh, the fairy dreams is gonna give us some gorgeous reactions there. So this is the fun part. We're gonna go ahead and tilt. And as we tilt, that marble is going to move around and it's going to wreck that pattern. Now, how much it wrecks it is totally up to you. And you can really move it around any which way you want. It's really fun. This is a great one to do with the whole family, I think. Um, and the marble moving around also pulls kind of other colors in with it and moves them around the canvas. Once you're more or less happy with your design, feel free to run the marble off the canvas at any point in time. And if you accidentally run the marble off the canvas when you're not done, feel free to just put it back on. <laughs> Run it off over here. No, not yet. Not yet. A little more. There we go. <laughs> okay. So then just go ahead and finish off your tilt, whichever way you'd want. Getting the corners covered and spreading your design out however you like it. I am very, very happy with my color selection here. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and just take a second to touch up sides and corners and then we will bring you guys in for a close up. 